I've like grown up as a musician, artist, singing and choir and all that stuff. I'm, you know, in Oakland, Oakland, California. And uh, along the way, you know, like I, I remember Bruce Lee having a studio, his Kung Fu studio on Broadway near MacArthur. Nice. I was just born. Yeah, I was just born up, up the street from there, you know. So like, you know, a lot of my friends in Chinatown took Kung Fu lessons, you know, some okay. with him and some with, you might know his famous nemesis, Jack Man Wong. Yes, yeah, yeah, Wong Jack Man, yeah. yeah. So, Wong Jack Man, yeah. yeah. Yeah, I I actually studied with him as a child. Oh, okay, so you did do some yeah. arts. I, well, I wouldn't say I did it. I was too young. I, I just remember going because my brothers, you know, were signed up and that I would go. And I was probably like seven or eight at the time. And I was too young. I was not disciplined to stand there and do the, you know, horse stance and punch and everything. Right. And I just remember Jack Wong, Jack Man yelling at me all the time, you know. Like, <laughs> I was too young, you know. And no. um, so I remember that and, that. and then we started seeing, you know, the first... Uh, bits, hearing the first bits about Bruce, Bruce Lee becoming well known in film, and you know, it was like the Chinese connection, the Fist of Fury, and, and work right. at around like he teaches, he's he teaches in Oakland, you know, right? And, yeah. And then I heard that our teacher got in a had a match with him, you know, the famous right. match, the fight, the famous fight. Yeah, and uh, you know, this was only this was later on when I really pieced it all together because at the time it, it didn't really mean anything. We just heard there was a fight with our teacher and Bruce, you know. It didn't mean anything just in the community and later on years later you start reading about this infamous match and you're like wow that was that you know wow uh, i really don't know who won that kind of stuff we don't know anything about that you yeah know, it's, all it's, myth, it's you know, so many ways i know and then there's a book everything i know i know exactly exactly and then uh, i was mainly an artist and musician went to school san francisco state got my fine art degree but at the time i was you know i was into performing you know, doing performance art, experimental theater because of music. And, and suddenly I found myself acting when I moved to New York City. It just seemed uh, like the natural progression. And uh, in acting, people ask, you know, as an Asian man, I'm supposed to know Kung Fu or something. <laughs> right. I know Kung Fu. Show me. Exactly. It's like, why, why, why are you here? You know? Either that or it's you're like, really good at math, right? One of the two. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> and I wasn't good at either, you know? Okay, right. I, I was that unmodeled minority that was not good at either, you know? I'm, and um, so I, you know, but, but I was, I could fake it quite well, you know, because I had some understanding. I saw a lot of Kung Fu films. I was a fan of all the Run Run Shaw, Shaolin uh, epics, you know, uh, Golden yes, Harvest. Yes. You know, I was a fan of all of those films. And, and so it was like in me. And I grew up watching Bruce Lee. He was my idol. He right. was the only reason I said, I can do that. Without yeah. him, I wouldn't have said, you know, there was no one in American media, Western media.